Hey Planner Babes, it's Amber from Amber Plans Your Day and I just want to come on and unbox the newest Plan Anything subscription box. So make sure you stay tuned. So this month's box is called Floral Fun. You can see that it is going to be beautiful purples, deep indigos, just some absolutely beautiful florals. The back of the card always says what it comes with. So if you guys ever want like a sneak peek, um, the card is always a great way to kind of know what's expected in the box. And um, this is from Plan Anything or Plan Anything. It depends how you say it. Um, I've always said Plan Anything. It's definitely like a play on words where it says plan and anything in the same thing, but it can also be called plan anything. So just in case you're curious about that, um, this box sells for $30 if you purchase the subscription box. So the subscription is every single month you will get a box of items similar to this, but also um, different items and different designs each month for $30 or you can buy just this purple floral fun box for the month of June um, as the product is available and that costs $35 so it depends how you guys want to do it if you guys just like the one box just grab the one or if you want to subscribe and get something fun to your door every single month $30 from the 1st to the 24th of the month which is just awesome. I'll make sure I have my affiliate linked down below in case you want to purchase and support me. So let's see what is in this box. We're going to start with the paper. I am so excited. Okay, so this is a really deep blue indigo color, I would say. And then it has like the floral border and then the back. Ooh, it's like a light purple with the florals on it. That's so pretty. That's really pretty. I think I might use this side for a memory keeping page. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that because that I have a really good idea. It's my anniversary month. So I think that'd be really fun. And we have some more paper, a second page. Super pretty on both sides. And then we have two sheets here of um, acetate. Two acetate sheets. So... They're like kind of this clear, shiny, see-through page. This one is like a purple with the florals on it. And then this one here, I want to try that where you guys don't really see the reflection, but that's kind of hard. Um, it is like a light purple with the florals on it too. And I think this would be so fun like to make your own divider out of if you punch it. Definitely want to try that out. I've never had an acetate sheet before. So that's really exciting. Then you got your pen. This is just a typical ballpoint pen. This is like a light pink, lavender almost um, color. And you can just see that it's just a regular ballpoint pen. And then it has like all the fun little jewels in it. Love it. Um, okay, then we have sticky notes. Let's see. One sticky notes. I actually love the size of this. This is like perfect just for quick little, it's like a pretty small sticky note pad. Really good quick little note that you need to like call mom or something. Put it on your mirror. Tons of them there. Light purple with the floral border. Super cute. And then we do have three rolls of washi tape. So you have a purple, like a light colored purple. And let me see if I can show you guys real quick. This one's actually really pretty. It's like a kind of a whitish color with like the green leaves. And that just like matches so well. And then this one looks like it's a little bit of a darker color. Yeah, it's like a darker, darker blue indigo with the florals on it. Those are so pretty. I love that they that she included like a neutral one to kind of um, keep them all together and just kind of bring in that light color a little bit more too. So there's those three. What else do we have? We have this pouch. This is a pretty good size pouch. This would fit with tons of pens and it has that beautiful design on it. 
just a great zipper pouch and the inside just that same fabric tons of space you guys I can fit my whole hand easy in there oh it's so pretty too I love the purple florals okay and then okay, we're gonna do stickers last of course then we have two stencils I'm actually gonna be showing you guys how to use these as well I'll probably show you guys that at the end of this video um, just an idea of how you can use these stencils because I one of my favorite spreads ever included stencils and I want to show you guys a fun way to use them so you have flowers and leaves and then the stickers that we have we have some clear stickers some floral bundles like uh, bouquets some single florals and then some smaller single florals with some of the leaves we have some paper stickers now these are hexagons love the purples the pinks the greens all matches so well and we have colorful boxes and we have some circles as well super pretty love those okay so that is everything that comes in this box again you guys the box runs for if you get the subscription so you get something every single month it runs for thirty dollars if you grab just the single box that is while supplies last that is um thirty five dollars and if you sub if you're gonna do the subscription remember to subscribe by the 24th of the month so i'm gonna go grab oh actually i have a ton of paper right here well actually let's go grab my ink so i'll be right back and we i'm gonna show you guys about the stencils because the stencils are some of my favorites i'm so excited for those and then i'll be back like later in the month i'm going to use the stickers in a spread in my classic planner but i already planned for my planner this week so i have to wait um for um either next week or the week after to use these stickers i'm so excited for it though but make sure you guys stay tuned i'm going to show you guys how to use this in just a minute so i just grabbed this block pad this is basically going to be like a running to-do list for me of things that I need to get prepped for release on Friday for Amber Plants Her Day, but I think this will be so fun. I'm going to show you guys one example of when I actually did this technique, if I can find it. I just saw it in here, you guys. Okay, maybe it was in October. Here it is. Okay, so you can see these leaves here. I actually used a stencil on them. This was before planning anything. This is a long time. It was like 20, I don't know. What year is this? 2018. This was three years ago. But this spread was so much fun to make. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that, but with the plan anything stuff. So this is just some ink that I grabbed at Michael's. I'm sure there's tons of ink out there that is amazing and works just as well and um at this point might work even better than this because this is literally like 20 years old not 20 years old like three years old so basically all you do this is how well, this is what i did for my spread i just put the stencil down and this the cool thing about this ink is it comes off of the wheel and you just kind of like pat it on it kind of messy so just be prepped for a mess but then watch this watch this <gasps> look at that it's amazing oh my goodness it's gorgeous okay and then you're gonna put this back like I said you guys it can get a little messy there's probably a better way to do this, but this is just how I did it. I'm going to just get this plastic that it came with, put it there, and I think I'm going to grab this bright green. And I think we're going to try to go with like a kind of a berry look here. Boop! Beautiful! I think we're even going to try to put one here. Cute. Oh, I love it. Okay. 
And then I think because the, um, the box actually had some of this like darker color as well, I'm thinking I might do like a smaller, maybe like a smaller floral of this guy. So I literally just tap, 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 and then I just pull it off. And like I said, it can be messy, so just be prepared for that. But that looks so pretty. So I kind of just made my own little corner bouquet here with the stencils. Of course, you can like just trace it and color it in, but this is such a fun way to use them um, that I think everyone should try at least once. And uh, hello. Okay, run. Yeah, this one. I'm wrapping up this film, so. So I think we're gonna do like a little bit of a darker green one up here, kind of like a darker green um, leaf pattern. Oh, that's pretty. I do feel like I might need some darker green down here though. I might like do, I might just do part of this leaf here. Cute, okay, perfect. And then we're gonna do, I think we might do another purple floral because purple is like my favorite color. So I'm just gonna turn this. And remember, you guys, this is messy. It's fun and beautiful, but it's also messy. So just be prepared for the mess. Whoop, there we go. Make sure you hold it pretty good so that it doesn't get all over the place. Do, 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 do. There's probably like a better way. Like you probably even just paint over this with like a paintbrush or something. Like I said, this is what I did years ago and I loved it. So there it is. And now I can just write whatever I want to do list wise in this middle section here. Um, and uh, it looks so pretty. It really looks gorgeous. Let me see if I can hold it up for you guys just a little bit. So that's one way that you can use these stencils from the Plan Anything subscription box for the month of June is with ink, um, which is like, this is just pigment ink from Michaels. You can use probably any ink, your favorite ink, whatever ink you want, um, and create a very similar pattern. And then what I do is I just take a baby wipe and I just wipe this off with a baby wipe and it literally just cleans them back up. It's amazing. So I kind of think I want to put a sticker on here, a box sticker for my to do's. I think I'm going to do that like darker indigo -y blue color. And I'm just going to say like to do this week. That's what that's going to say. And then that's it. Now I'm done. Now I have a to do list for the week. Well, not really for the week, but to prep for my release. And it is pretty simple and just like fun to look at. Thank you guys so much for following along as I unbox the floral fun plan anything subscription box. I hope that you guys will continue to follow along as I plan my life day to day and continue to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel.